Question 19. Wendy has two containers A and B of the same mass but different capacities. Container A has a capacity of 1,000 cubic centimeters and container B has a capacity of 1,200 cubic centimeters. She fills container A to the brim with water as shown in the diagram below. So she fills container A fully to the brim. Which of the following correctly states what will happen if she pours all the water in container A into container B? Well, let's take a look at the options. The water level and mass will change. When she pours container A, all of the water in container A to container B, the water level will change. But the mass will not change because the volume of water remains the same. So, A cannot be the correct option. The shape and mass of water will change. The shape of the water will change as the water takes the shape of the container. But again, as I say, the mass of water will not change because the volume of water remains the same. So B cannot be a correct option. Option C, the shape of water will change while the mass of water will remain unchanged. This is what we have been talking about. The shape of water will take the shape of the container B. So the shape of water will change, but the mass of water will remain unchanged as the volume of water remains the same. So C is a correct option. Option D, the water level will change while the mass of water will remain unchanged. Again, as I say before, although container A is being filled to the brim because container B has a bigger capacity, so when A is poured into B, it will not fill container B to the brim. So the water level will change, but the mass of water will remain unchanged because the volume of water remains the same. So D is also a correct option. So answer is C and D, which is option 2. So answer is 2.